All right, so uh, we are having Pisces and Moon and as well rising a weekly general tarot reading for the period February 17 to February 23rd, 2020. And in case any of you guys is interested in a personal reading with me, uh, you can check out the description down below and there you're gonna find a uh, link to my website from which you can purchase um, a such a personal reading. So that being said, moving to the Pisces General Tarot reading here, the first card, which stands for the topic of your week, guys, is going to be the Four of Pentacles, followed by the next one here, which represents uh, the energies which are feeding up the topic itself. And we do have another amazing card, which is the Ace of Pentacles there, followed by the challenges that you will have to overcome throughout the week. Uh, that is to be the chariot uh, and then what we have it is the uh, gifts and the blessings that you can enjoy throughout the week here we have the tree of wands furthermore the next one it is how you're going to look like in front of others what kind of a person they're going to see in you there and that will be the tower card very very powerful one and the last one that we do have in this reading which is the guidance that tower is offering to you we do have the uh, ace of wands uh perfect so pisces now uh, these couple of cards here guys it does point that the unfoldment of the week itself is to lead you to a, a very i would say big stability in term of a comfort and as well in term of what you are to expect in the future but the energies themselves they are talking about a few things first of all those energies are going to make your uh, relationships not just only intimate relationships but as well a uh, a working type of relationships and friendships as well a harmonious so you can expect that a an, an argument or a wrangles that you do have in between you and those people to be either resolved or as well to be kind of like a uh, uh, losing their relevance at all so they will simply disappear and additionally to that the ace of pentacles as an energy gives you the prerequisite the prerequisites to establish successful business or to be successful into the business that you are working at and that all leads to the situation itself which is the topic and the team and we do have the four of pentacles and based on these energies that will help you you know to establish good relationships and to be successful into your business as well you will be able to um establish uh, how can i how can i say it a uh, it's a comfort zone but it's more like to ensure a, a secure future it all it all it always it always comes with the four of pentacles that you are ensuring currently your secured future either career wise or either relationship wise by taking a, a solid positions in there amongst you know your social circle or into the relationship door that you are in or into the career path that you're in you know into the uh, job that you're working at and that will allow you to uh, defend and guard your standpoint in a sense of that whatever position you do occupy throughout this week it is very unlikely that anybody will be able to knock you off that particular position now um what about money though we do have pentacles right so money uh, you can strafe for a, a monetary success. This is with those uh, two cards here. However, with the Four of Pentacles, if you strive to the monetary success alone, or meaning that you do not share your good fortune with others, then that calls for a lonely and, a, and empty existence, which is going to be a problem because we have to go to the challenging card and that is to be the uh, chariot card. So challenge-wise, challenge uh, we do saw in the first couple of cards that that week is going to be extremely good week for consolidating, for stabilizing yourself in career and in relationship as well. And with the chariot, you have to do that 
on your own or by yourself if i have to say it that way only that way you are going to have the luck of your hard work you are going to be able to make one step closer or to yeah to make one step getting yourself closer to your wish fulfillment you are far away from that wish fulfillment but you are going to get one step closer to it as well and uh, that is to be as well uh, something to have with the recognition with the rewards of your labor also meaning that if you focus on those endeavors and on those enterprises by yourself without asking help from this person or from that person then that will uh, the rewards are going to be reciprocal uh, reciprocally or big in a reciprocal way meaning you know that if you are if your efforts are singular in there then all the rewards are to be for you and as we said you know that may create a lonely and empty existence so um how can i say it so judging by those cards guys you need to kind of have a, a point of break where you kind of like step on the brakes and decide you know moving forward going for more it's kind of not worth it so you 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 will need to kind of like draw yourself a, a line which you are not to trespass either career wise or either relationship wise but if we exclude this thing from the equation here the week looks very very promising for you uh pisces so if you especially if you are going through a turmoil up until this point you can definitely expect that this week the whole energies and the environment itself is going to call for a calmness and is going to call for a, a a room where you can stabilize and consolidate you know your your efforts and as well capitalizing on the circumstances that are forming around you so that leads us to the next one here which is the gifts and the blessings that you can enjoy and that is to be the tree of wands and tree of wands as a gift and blessing is about the room for expand in a sense of that if you thought that you have uh, succeed into reaching your maximum career-wise or relationship-wise you are dead wrong because that week as a gift and blessing you are to realize that if you push yourself a little bit further you know if you challenge yourself with becoming for example with expanding your relationship or with expanding your career you can definitely do it because with a gift and blessing the tree of wands represents you know the once again the chance or rather like the opportunity to expand on what you already have this this is not a a new enterprise okay this is expansion of the current enterprise meaning expansion of the current relationship expansion on the current job that you're doing we're not talking about a new jobs it's like having a field to grow in what you are already doing additionally to that as a gifts and blessings the tree of wands it is about uh, uh matching expectations with uh with efforts incorporated meaning that whenever you do something you know based on your efforts as with with what you're doing it you do have a certain expectations how it's to unfold and that is exactly how it's to unfold as well so uh, it's pretty much that points to a to severe amount of predictability in your actions throughout this week that you will be able to predict outcomes of your actions uh, that you are taking regarding a suitor of yours or of your partner or into the business that you are performing into so uh, that leads us to the next one here which stands as how people are going to take on you what kind of impression you're going to leave into people and that is going to be the tower card so people are going to see you as a person who has no remorse to do something to improve their personal circumstances even if that means to abandon leave or break certain situations meaning for example that if you are unhappy into your relationship your partner are going to see you as someone who does not exclude the option to break that relationship so to find itself or himself or herself a happy and that will make other people kind of like fear you in a sense of that they will they will know that you can cross a lines that they did not thought you were going to go there 
beforehand. No different than, for example, you are bullied at your career and at a certain point you just snap out and you are just willing to even you know walk away from that work and start to work another uh, into another place okay uh so you you're not getting bullied anymore or you get abused into your relationship and that card points that you can't stand it anymore or this is how the partner is going to see you okay that may not be your state at the moment but this is how they are going to see you and that will kind of make them a, a big impression that they cannot mess around with you for a much longer because at certain points of breaking it is what you are going to reach and afterwards it's going to be a point of no return and you would simply not care what is to happen and how the circumstances are to arrange because simply you will not have anything to lose or or to so this is how the people are going to see you so what i am trying to say here is that is a perfect week for you pisces to intimidate your way through okay it is a perfect way to do so and lastly if we're talking strictly about relationship this card may give a hint to your ex that you want to reconcile with them that doesn't mean that they want to reconcile with you okay so don't uh, mix those things around because the tower card when we're talking about broken relationship it is like picking up the pieces back and trying to glue them together and as this is the impression you are giving maybe this is how uh, some people from your social circle or your uh, ex girlfriend or your ex-boyfriend or even your ex-husband or a wife is to see you but it doesn't mean that is going to happen and the last one here it is the guidance that tarot is offering we do have the ace of wands and that card points that you will have um a momentum because the ace of wands in these cases is like the the spark of inspiration you know you see that you can you, you can stabilize you see that you can establish a comfort zone for yourself that you can ensure a, a very good future for yourself very predictable and very peaceful future for yourself and that momentum needs to be kept up with additionally to that the ace of wands here points that your performance or say the routine that you're going to have throughout the week the daily routine is going to be quite enterprising on its own accord and you get to jump into it and kind of like show who is the boss and it's exactly what you got to do and throughout the week february 17th to february 20 23rd so pisces it does look like guys that uh, especially to those who are um who are taking who are kind of like under underestimating you or are kind of trying to abuse you in one or another way or to take advantage of you it does look like that you're going to show them who is the boss and that they cannot once again mess around with you for a much longer so yeah that being said pisces this was your weekly uh general tarot reading february 17th to february 23rd 2020 hopefully you enjoyed it and you liked it guys and we're going to uh see each other hopefully uh next time until then bye